Hello, everyone. Today, I'm going to demonstrate to you on how to use the picker wheel. Are you all excited? Okay. So the first thing that you have to do is you have to go first to your browser, your Google Chrome, and then key in www.google.com and then type picker wheel. After that, you have to select picker wheel. So this will be the, the workspace of picker wheel. So there's an input here. So you have to write the name of your students. For example, I will write here, Maria. Just click enter. Angelo. James. Anna. So you can input uh, the names of your students so that later in your discussion, you can ask them using this speaker wheel to select your students who will answer the questions if you want to have an interactive discussion. Or if you don't want, if you have some prepared um, list of names, you can add here. Just, just click this folder and then try to open list. But you must have to log in first or sign up. And then type your email address if you have a list of names. For example, if, it, if it's located to your um, Google or for, on your Facebook. Okay. But for this demonstration, I'm just going to give you the initial, I mean, the, the names of the students. Okay, once you're done listing the names of your students, you can now easily use yeah, the spinning wheel, okay, the picker wheel. So all you have to do is just to spin, I mean, press the spin button, okay? Right. And once it is selected, students will be called to answer the questions. Okay, so that's it. It's very easy. So if you want to have uh, it to have the speaker wheel on your um, desktop, all you have to do is to click here, the three dots and then go to more options and then create shortcut and then use open as window and then select create now it will create a shortcut command so you will notice here in your desktop that it will be there is a shortcut here so if you want to go in directly, you just have to click picker wheel, select picker wheel and automatic. Yeah, it will show in your desktop. So that's it. It's really, it's very easy. All you have to do is to use the picker wheel to have an interactive class discussion and your students will be motivated to participate. Hope you've learned something. Thanks.